We're in this field today. The sword's getting quite tired, um, so there's been a decision made to renew it. It's important to have a look at the soil, its structure, and for any compaction layers, so to make sure that your cultivation choice is, is appropriate. You're trying to get a, a spit of soil out of the ground to about 20 centimeters. We've extracted the soil block out. How deep it is can depend upon how firm the soil is. It can be more difficult in some loosely structured soils. So we're mainly here today to try to understand the soil structure in terms of commonly used um, definitions. So we want to start to break this up. And what we're looking for is sort of the primary unit, okay? And as you see, it is quite a firm soil. Definitely time for this field to be brought into cultivation for renewal. But as you can see, I'm starting to break, break apart the soil peds and I'm looking for the sort of primary structure the one that becomes a bit more difficult to break up and that's your sort of core structure okay and in this instance we're getting quite small and this is when we can start to look at the vest system it has a, a, a one to five evaluation mainly just about compaction levels and therefore loss of soil structure issue that, that, that you should be aware of when you come to management. In this instance, we're breaking the pet down into probably into what we call this SQ2 area. Basically easy to break apart with one hand as a mixture of porous rounded aggregates. So the actual way the aggregate look are part of the evaluation as well. And the rooting systems, the roots are, are all clearly into there. Okay, and this is for this upper soil profile. So I would say we could probably comfortably say it's an SQ2. It, with this system, that's not any sort of, there's no sort of clear issues related to soil structure. I still think that the soil slightly compacted so it hasn't impacted the underlying structure so concerns around long-term management as to renewal of organic material wouldn't necessarily be of great concern or primary concern for this field but the, the lower half of the profile a bit more firm definitely I would say we're getting into a, a lower like an SQ3 okay the aggregates are slightly larger they're more firmly held together so I'm getting to the point where they're not as easily broke apart at a, and they're larger in size so this is a, of a concern for us but ideally we'd like to see more roots down here and I think that's due in part to drainage but also in part to a slight reduction or in soil structure so we've come one field over from where we just did that last evaluation into a field which is there's no really any clear um, concerns there's not any plans to renew the grass uh, it's generally considered to be producing well just so that we can get a bit of a contrast in terms of the, the vest system and see if there's any difference so what we've seen so far is we've seen a very much similar in terms of the upper profile coming out um, <laughs> distinct from the from the lower half at about uh, 10 12 centimeters, 12 centimeters or so uh, which is being this is being held together by the root systems itself I'm not seeing any of the clear drainage restrictions or concerns that I had before not the modeling there okay this looks and, and the rooting the, the roots are definitely they're uh, more common we're getting down to an s2 for sure so again that's based upon partly on the shape of the, the the aggregate but also its size as we move into the second half of this 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 spit we start to see a fairly high degree of compaction at this depth so we're just not getting enough roots in there the big message here is that I would expect to see the rooting system to be getting much further down into the profile. You can gain some very valuable information for, for, for um, best practice in land management by doing this simple process. This is a vest and it's available from the uh, Valuing Your Soils booklet and also from the Farm Advisory Services website, the FAST website. Um, and a fairly straightforward process uh, and uh, hopefully as you can see today uh, can, can be very informative about, um, uh, about making sure that you're doing the right uh, management strategy for your, for your fields.